Imagine a world where the best disguise isn't just for fun, it's a matter of life and death. Welcome to the incredible world of camouflage, where survival is an art form. Today, we're going to explore the fascinating strategies animals use to vanish in plain sight. You might think of camouflage as just blending into the background, but it goes far beyond that. From altering color to changing textures, and even imitating other species' shapes, animals have evolved countless ways to hide. Camouflage is nature's greatest illusion. It's how predators sneak up on prey and prey avoid predators. From perfectly blending into the background to mimicking other species, the ways animals adapt are astonishing. Imagine being able to change your colors like the octopus or blend into a snowy landscape like the arctic fox. It's nature's ultimate trick. In essence, camouflage can be broken down into three key strategies. Blending in, also called cryptic coloration, disruptive patterns, where stripes or patterns break up an animal's outline, and mimicry, where an animal imitates a different creature or object. Some creatures even combine more than one strategy, like the walking stick insect, which not only looks like a twig, but also sways in the breeze to enhance the illusion. Deep in the forests, stick insects sway like leaves in the wind, while leaf insects become one with their surroundings. Then there's the tawny frogmouth, a bird so skilled at blending in, it looks like a broken branch. Some insects even mimic the textures of moss and lichens to stay hidden. Forest environments provide infinite hiding spots, dense foliage, knotted roots, and thick bark. The key for many insects is matching not just color, but shape and texture. Some caterpillars have tiny bumps and ridges along their backs that mimic plant stems or lichen-covered bark. Even predators, like certain snakes or tree-dwelling reptiles, evolve leaf-like patterns to surprise unsuspecting prey in the dim, dappled light. Beneath the waves, the ocean is full of masters of disguise. Octopuses and cuttlefish change their appearance in seconds, creating living magic tricks. They not only use their camouflage to hunt, but also to escape predators. Meanwhile, stonefish lie in wait, perfectly camouflaged until their next meal swims by. And let's not forget the mimic octopus, which can imitate the shape and movement of other sea creatures like lionfish and even sea snakes. The devil scorpionfish is another incredible ocean dweller. It lies motionless on the ocean floor, looking just like a rock until an unsuspecting fish gets too close. Scientists continue to study the complex skin of cephalopods, octopuses, squids, and cuttlefish because they can change color and texture via specialized cells called chromatophores, iridophores, and leucophores. These cells allow them to match patterns of light and shadow with uncanny precision. Some octopuses can even create fake eye spots to startle predators, then vanish into the background the moment hesitation sets in. In the harsh desert, the key to survival is to remain unseen. Horned lizards vanish into the sand, while desert snakes use their scales to blend seamlessly into the landscape. The desert's stark environment means every grain of sand and rock counts when hiding. Did you know that the fringe-toed lizard uses its speed to kick up sand, creating a dust cloud that aids in its escape? Many desert species are also active at dawn or dusk, when shadows are long and colors blend into the muted palette of the sand. This behavioral adaptation, coupled with sandy or rock-like coloration, helps them avoid the scorching daytime heat and detection by predators. For instance, the sidewinder rattlesnake's unique sideways slithering motion also reduces the amount of its body in contact with the hot sand while simultaneously leaving misleading tracks. In the icy Arctic, camouflage is critical. Arctic foxes shift their coats with the seasons, while polar bears blend into the snow to stalk their prey. 
and the snowy owl, it's a ghost of the tundra, almost invisible in its frozen home. This extreme environment has shaped some of the most specialized forms of camouflage in the animal kingdom, with animals evolving to blend into not just snow, but also shadows. Even the ptarmigan, a bird native to Arctic regions, changes its feathers to match the snow in winter and to match the rocks in the summer. Interestingly, while the polar bear's fur appears white, each hair shaft is actually transparent, scattering light in a way that makes the bear look snow-colored. Beneath it all, the bear's skin is black, absorbing heat from the sun. It's a perfect example of how camouflage can serve multiple purposes, blending in for hunting while also retaining warmth in one of the coldest environments on Earth. Some animals don't just blend in, they become works of art. Chameleons use color not only to hide, but to communicate. And pygmy seahorses? They're so perfectly matched to their coral homes, you'd miss them even if you were looking right at them. Some seahorses even adapt their color based on the health of the coral they live in. It's camouflage and habitat awareness rolled into one. Chameleons in particular are famous for their color shifting abilities. While camouflage is one reason for their remarkable transformations, changes in color can also reflect mood, temperature, or social signals. Chameleon might turn darker if threatened or become brightly patterned during a territorial dispute, all while remaining surprisingly difficult for predators to detect in lush foliage. But how do they do it? Camouflage is more than just luck. It's biology in action. From chromatophores in octopuses to the precise patterns in animal fur and feathers, nature's ingenuity is unmatched. Imagine having skin that could mimic light and shadow as easily as a painter blends colors on a canvas. Humans have taken many lessons from nature's camouflage. In the military, uniforms are designed to blend into surroundings just like animals do in the wild. Hunters use camo gear inspired by forest patterns to stay hidden from prey. Even fashion and art have adopted the intricate designs of animals, showing how camouflage is both functional and beautiful. From the mimicry of stick insects in the forest to the texture shifting octopuses in the ocean, camouflage comes in countless forms. In deserts, it's about blending with sand and rocks. In the Arctic, survival depends on matching the snow and shadows. Each technique is a testament to nature's creativity and adaptability, crafted perfectly for its environment. Camouflage is a reminder of nature's creativity and resilience. From the forests to the oceans, the deserts to the Arctic, these animals show us that survival is an art form. Thanks for exploring with me, and as always, stay wild.